Hello, hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. I hope you're having a lovely day out there wherever you may be, wherever you are watching this video. I appreciate you stopping by. So, we are back listening to the Sex Pistols for one reason and one reason only because at your request. A lot of people in the comments of the last video in which we had finished the album, and we still have technically finished the album, said, hey, where's Submission? Submission's on the track. Submission's on the album. Where You didn't finish the album. However, however, hold on, because I'm following. Listen, I always follow the original track listing, and I just pull up what's given to me, right? And Submission is not on the original track listing. Here's the reason. The album's official release date for the UK was intended as the 4th of November 1977. However, copies were released prior to this, mid to late October 1977, by Virgin Records. Initially available only as an 11 track album and omitting the track submission. So the record label got a little ahead of the gun a little bit and they released the album earlier and the that track submission was not in the original, technically the original release, the first release. Uh, but it was put back in after that. So that's why I didn't listen to it because it wasn't on the original track list, nor did it show up on any of the track list. Uh, it doesn't show up on Discogs, doesn't show up on Wikipedia. And usually those are what I, I go to uh, for the original track listings. But we'll listen to it today. Anyways, let's go ahead and pull it up. We'll talk about it after. Here we go. code in there, huh? This could have been a radio hit for him. It's catchy. And snappy. The crowd is chanting that. Catchy guitar riff too. Interesting sound they got there. Out of all songs, I don't know why this is the one that was omitted. I love how he holds that note.
why was this the track that was omitted from the album? Why was this kicked off? Because this is <laughs> this is really good, and I could so easily see this song being a single from the album, catchy, uh, put it on the radio for the band, and like, not that they you know lack any credibility, popularity, or anything like that. But this song, I feel like, would have charted pretty well. Uh, snappy, snappy music, great drumming. Uh, love all the guitar work in here, especially not just like the main riff, which is right. It's it's hard, but it's melodic. But all of the sound effects that I'm imagining Jones is creating with his guitar in there, uh, which kind of give it like a little bit of this underwater, watery kind of feel. And he's playing around a lot in the midst of that, which I think is fantastic. Obviously, Rotten sounds really good as well. I love that note that he holds there at the end. He still infuses some of his, to my, in my opinion, those punk playful isms <laughs> into the music. Like at the very end there, when he kind of does this, Ugh! like, you know, just like those little things. I think the middle section is fantastic. Uh, we get a lot of melody in this track too which once again, I think would really capture audiences and kind of bring in new ears. So I'm not sure why this one was kicked off the album out of all the songs on here, but that's what happened. I'm on a submarine mission for you, baby. I feel the way you were going. I feel you picked up on my TV screen. I feel your undercurrent flowing. I'm, I'm taking this two ways. I'm taking this like because of all the water references, talking about going underwater and all this other stuff, like submission, like a submarine going on a mission underwater, diving in the depths. I also think submission, just one word, literally submission, and perhaps diving into some other sorts of depths. Submission going down, dragging her down, submission. I can't tell you what I found. You've got me pretty deep, baby. You can't figure out your watery love. Gotta solve your mystery. You're sitting it out in heaven above. It's a mystery under the sea and the water. I want to share it. Because it's a secret under the water in the sea. It's an octopus rock. Got me pretty deep, baby. I can't figure out your watery love. Gotta solve your mystery while you're sitting in heaven above. Let me know what you guys thought of it. You can let me know in the comments down below. You can follow me over on Twitter. Support the channel on Patreon. Thank you guys so much for the recommendation. Thank you for uh, telling me to finish the album in a proper way. And that's it. Hope you have a lovely day out there. I'll see you later, guys. Bye.